New tonight at 10 o'clock, a parent's nightmare turns into a miracle for a family from Leroy, Alabama, when they found out their two-year-old daughter had a massive tumor on her spine. Pilots for Christ, a nonprofit group that relies on donations, flew the family to Texas for surgery just in the nick of time. News 5's Emily DeVoe has the story you will see only on News 5. Two-year-old Sadie Margaret has already been through a lot in her short life. <laughs> She's just our little miracle. Just our little miracle. Just a few months after she was born, Sadie Margaret started having back pains. She had terrible nights where she screamed and, and uh, it didn't happen very often. It was very erratic, but it started progressing more and more. Just as a mother, I knew something just wasn't right. I was a first time mom, so I was, at, I took her to the pediatrician. They just told me maybe night terrors. For the next year and a half, the Richardson family went from doctor to doctor without any luck until an MRI scan earlier this month. And the room fell quiet, and I just, as a mother, I just knew. There was a massive spinal, a, a massive tumor in her spinal cord. This is the day. Doctors wanted to operate almost immediately to remove the tumor, worried if they waited too late, Sadie Margaret would never be able to walk again. It was as high stakes for her in this surgery as it could be. The nonprofit Pilots for Christ flew the family to MD Anderson in Texas, where doctors removed 90% of the tumor. It um, covered most of her back. Hey. What happened the next is something her mom calls a miracle. Sadie Margaret could walk. It was amazing. He used miracle, the word miracle, and he used the word astonishing that she could walk. Wide open. God had his hand on this the whole time. You are doing good. And it's power of prayer that has taken place and has healed Sadie Margaret. Pilots for Christ flew the family back home just a day after Christmas. It's a blessing to us to be able to help them and help them get back and forth in a timely manner. This is a Oh, just a wonderful organization. While Sadie Margaret will still have to see a doctor every three months or so to check on the remaining 10% of the tumor, they're optimistic that her problems are behind her. She is our Christmas miracle. In Fairhope, Emily DeVoe, News 5. She is precious. Doctors don't know what type of tumor it was. They're waiting on test results, but the Richardson say doctors believe it was a low grade tumor, most likely benign. So Sadie Margaret won't need any kind of chemo or radiation. Well, the new year is less than a week away and many are making a resolution to stop smoking. The Alabama Department of Public Health offers free